Hi, my name is Tracy Morrison at CelibateMom.com and I'm vlogging today for Mama Cat's weekly writing workshop. And the vlog topic today is, can you tell more? <laughs> Hi there, this is Tracy Morrison with CelibateMom.com and I'm vlogging today for Mama Cat's writing workshop talking about where my blog name came from. Um, I do have a very unusual blog name, Celibate Mom, and I do get asked about it a lot. The biggest question I get though is, did you know that you spelled celibate wrong? Yes, I do. Um, my husband actually came up with my blog name because I'm very 1800s like that, and I let him make all the decisions for our family, including my blog name. Um, basically, he was complaining one evening three years ago that he never gets lucky and um, pretty much that hasn't changed. So um, we were using that word of him not getting lucky. Um, celibate spelled the correct way and the fact that I work um, almost full-time in sales and so I sell a lot or a bit and so we took those two words and put them together to confuse the hell out of people basically and for the last three years all I've done is explain my blog name. Um, it could have been simple, I could have named it Coffee It's Not Just For Breakfast Anymore or Mommy Loves Wine More Than You Sometimes um, or something cute like um, Nose Hairs and Cellulite but that was taken or Deuce um, that was also taken. Um, or I could have said, hey, my mommy wears diapers just like me. Um, but maybe that was also taken. So I chose celibate mom. Do I regret that decision? Um, no. Um, sometimes it's a pain in the ass to explain it to everybody, especially after you explain it, they still give you that look of, did you know you spelled it wrong? So um, anyway, any other questions, let me know. Um, and thanks so much.